Okay, so I let this sink in for the last couple of days regarding the Nintendo Direct that we saw recently. Every time I look back at it, I'm just like, where, where, where is the Mario game? Where is Breath of the Wild 2? Like, what? Why? Why is... Where? <laughs> I sit there and I question, like, where is the big games? Or maybe, maybe because I... I, I keep forgetting that E3 is in June, so I guess we gotta wait four extra months to find out what big titles are coming through on the Switch, because I'm not gonna lie to y'all, the Switch been dry. <laughs> it's just sitting there collecting dust, like I gotta, I, I, need, I need something new. Like, Metroid Dread almost got me, but in the end, I just, I mean look, we got Mario Strikers, that's cool, I did get a good reaction out of that, I was like, oh my god, I like this game, cool. Cool. And then I see Kirby. It's almost similar to Mario Odyssey. I like that as well. But but we ended off with Xenoblade Chronicles 3. And it's like, maybe that's on me because I'm not playing any Xenoblade game. So maybe I should get up on that. And maybe I'll have a different tune down the line. Um, I haven't played a Splatoon game ever in my life. So there's that. Uh, and there's like a lot of indie games that I'm not really interested in. So... This kind, this Nintendo Direct was kind of dry for me. It was dry. I'm not gonna lie to you. So it was kind of hard for me to sit there and think, "Oh my God, this Direct was cool," but in reality, it was kind of dry. It was. So I don't know what to do. I don't know. It's like my little quick thoughts on the Nintendo Direct. Oh, and I dropped the Mario Kart 8 gameplay yesterday literally discussing the whole Mario Kart 8 thing like bro why, why are we getting extra courses for the next year and a half why <laughs> it's like sure but we need more we need more with that we need more features then we can't just have courses and call it a day give, give me something y'all try with the whole oh Mario Kart in your home or Mario Kart outside whatever no nah. So maybe I do gotta wait the E3 weekend for that to happen. The E3 week, I gotta wait for something big to happen. It's like I look at the games, it's like, the games I wanna get, they're kinda old now. There's not really new games that I'm interested in other than Strikers, Breath of the Wild 2, and also the, what do you call it? And also Kirby as well. So those three games, man, so far, I, I, I was hoping at least an announcement like, hey, we're working on a new 3D Mario game because Mario Odyssey was fire. I played that game, I bought it one week, and I finished it at the end of it. Metroid is Metroid. What do you want me to say about Metroid? I, I'm not going to sit here and get hyped over Metroid yet. The, the, what was it? Free uh, update. It's like, why are you announcing an update on a direct when you could have just announced it on its own and then call it a day? So what do you guys think? Leave your comments down below. What do you guys think of the Nintendo Direct? I honestly think it was dry, but if you play the games that they announced, then I guess... It was probably a great direct in your opinion. Let me know in the comments. Should I get on Xenoblade? Should I try something else? Maybe that's the case. I don't know. Leave your comments down below. Hope you all enjoy. Like, subscribe, and I'm out. Later. Swag.